have the grits going. Some regular bacon. Just watch me break in y'all it is 70 degrees so it's a little cooler the sun is out i have a hoodie on but i know before it's all over with i probably come out of this hoodie but right now it's a little it's a little chilly so i have my hoodie on yep but i'm corey behind me he back there the red shirt on and we just getting out walking so remember last vlog y'all i told y'all that they were doing maintenance on the <clears throat> at this walking trail <clears throat> excuse me so they uh what do you call it when they, they put the black top on asphalt on the trail and the parking lot and then they painted uh the parking lot and the little parking stoppers or whatever you want to call them in the parking lot so it looks really nice and I told y'all they added a workout pad so let me show y'all so the, the the trail was not black like this at first so they put that asphalt on there that's the workout pad that was definitely, that was there before the maintenance, but that is still a, a new addition. So everything is freshly painted. The grass is nice and cut. Uh, it looks nice out here. It feels good. I'm actually starting to warm up with this hoodie on. But it's nice and breezy. So... We do have a cold front schedule to come through, so this is the beginning. I guess tomorrow is actually supposed to be uh, as low as 54, 55, so we're supposed to get even colder tomorrow. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> and then Monday is a holiday, so man, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So anyway, y'all, let me go ahead and get my walk in. And I'll check in later. I didn't record that much yesterday. I did record my walk 
because um, me and Cora did go walk, but then I spent the uh, the most of Saturday doing hair. So I did two of my granddaughter's hair. I posted one of them on the short. Uh, but that's bas basically all I did yesterday, y'all. So it was really nothing much to record. So today, me, Kendall, and Jack, we're getting out for lunch real quick. I have... Say hey, Kendall. <laughs> hey, y'all. I have Kendall with me. Jack is going to meet us, and we're going to sit down and have a little lunch. And I'm really not sure what I'm going to do the rest of the day. While I'm out here, I may go to Trader Joe's. Y'all, we went in and out. <laughs> they did not have what I was... They don't have one closer to us? Mm -mm. This is the actual closest one to us. Yep. But they never have it. That's why I always look online because mm -hmm. it's like the third time I came looking for this uh, Brazilian nut body butter. They never have it in store, y'all. So, we'll just have to order it. <laughs> y'all, it is so crowded in there. I was like, oh, let's go. You can barely walk. Yeah. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. Hey. So y'all, we finally made it home and me and Kendall, we uh made a couple of stops. I think I told y'all already, Trader Joe's did not have what we went there looking for. But then we uh stopped at TJ Maxx. I wanted to go find me a new lunch bag for work but i wanted to find like a little cute one so i said let me go see if tj maxx has anything like that i didn't find that but I, let me show y'all what i picked up while i was in there oh yeah so got that tj maxx and i just saw i thought this was cute it's a little steve madden crossbody it's like a a, a furry material just in time for the change of season. It has this little pouch on it that you can take off. As you can wear it with or without this. It has detail on the strap. I guess you could wear it on the black side or the white side. But I thought this was so cute, y'all. does have a side zipper, another side pouch on the inside. But you know, a small little crossbody to take like, <clears throat> you go out for dinner real quick, you're going shopping, run errands, you know, you could throw your phone in there, a wallet, some lip gloss, a little lotion and perfume, you know, just something, something. And then the strap is adjustable. So you can make it smaller. So you could you could also wear it just as a small shoulder bag as well, or you can make it longer and wear it as a crossbody. So I just thought it was cute when I picked it up, y'all. Something to throw on with my jeans, you know. Outside zipper as well. So I thought that was cute. I just wanted to show y'all. That's all I got. Cause I, I went in there looking for a new lunch bag. <laughs> I don't know what is this for. I know they be giving you pouches for your, um, those earbuds everybody be wearing, but I don't know, you could put money in here or anything. I guess whatever you want. That's how that looks. So I just 
just wanted to show that to y'all. And how much was this? $24.99. $24.99. Is that a deal or what? now y'all <sighs> I think I'm gonna take me a little nap my food was good by the way I enjoyed my, my meal and me and Kendall stopped at a couple of stores so I got to walk a little bit to walk it off cause I was stuffed so I feel a little better now since we walked a little bit but I think I'm going to just relax the rest of the day tomorrow's a holiday um, I don't know. I I probably get up late. I always do that. If I do too much early, I'll rest. And then um, 8, 9 o'clock at night, I'm up doing stuff. And I think that's what's about to happen because I'm a little sleepy. <laughs> and I think I'm going to take me a nap, y'all. But if I do anything else, I will call y'all back. Y'all know today's Sunday. This is the day I cook. But that's probably going to happen late today, if it happens at all. It may, it may happen tomorrow, so. Hey, Roxanne again. Hey, y'all. Hey. Happy Monday. Happy Monday, y'all. It's Monday. I'm in McDonald's parking lot. I came to get me some coffee. And then I'm going to... Uh, this little donut shop close to the house. I'm going to get some donuts because everybody, well, not everybody, Corey has to work, but <clears throat> me, Jack, and Kendall, we off today. So, for me, it's going to be donuts and coffee. I can't tell you the last time I had a donut, so I'm going to treat myself to a donut today. So, that's going to be breakfast. I do not feel like cooking breakfast. Uh, because I am cooking today. I am cooking a meal today. So no breakfast. So That's what I'm doing y'all. So happy Monday. Um, just checking in. <laughs> just checking in. Y'all I haven't been to this McDonald's in a long time. I'm at the one that I always complain about. Well I used to. But then I stopped coming. I said let me give them a break. Let me give them time to get themselves together. Hey y'all, I'm back. <clears throat> so I forgot to mention mention to y'all that it is 64 degrees, y'all. It's 64 degrees outside, so it's pretty cool. Um, that coffee was a flop, so now I'm on my way to Starbucks. So y'all, the coffee looks like a cup of water with milk in it. I'm not even going to bring it back. Starbucks to get my drink and I'm going back inside y'all the weather is so beautiful the sun is out it's nice and cool and it's just turning out to be a beautiful beautiful day so hey y'all so I'm back in the car I decided to run out and get me a pedicure y'all Raven and Jack left. Uh, they left out together to go do whatever they going to do. Corey had a dentist appointment. So I'm going to get a pedicure. Because I'm in need. 
it's time. I was gonna do it myself, but I decided to just go ahead on and relax and get it done. So that's why I'm on my way to see. That's why I, I never like to say what I plan to do, cause I never keep to a certain script. You know, my plan was to go inside, start cooking, doing whatever, doing whatever I have to do in the house. But I'm going to give me a pedicure, then I'm going to the store. To the grocery store, and then I'm going home. So, y'all, today I changed into my the purse I bought yesterday. <laughs> I'm wearing it today since I had black in my attire, black and white. Why not use my little cross body today? Yeah, I bought it yesterday. And what? It. I love it though. I was itching. I couldn't wait to use it. I think it is so cute. I love, love, love it. But yep, yeah, y'all, yeah, that is what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to give me a quick pedicure. I never record too much of when I go get my pedicure because it's <laughs> it's a little awkward. But I always reassure the people that I try not to get them in it just like what they're doing and not them. Which I don't really think they care, but they always act like they don't understand. You know, if I tell them, um, I'm recording, but I'm not gonna um I'm not gonna put you in it, they'd be like, huh? Okay. You know, like they're not really I mean I, they know what I'm saying, I guess. I don't know. But then they go to talking to each other. <laughs> I'm going to put translator on my phone. I tried that one time, y'all, but I couldn't make out. I still, the translator wasn't making out what they were saying. But anywho, I'm almost there and I will call y'all back. Yeah. 
Instead of spending a whole lot of crying, a whole lot of trying, a whole lot of telling me I should be dying or feel like you. I don't wanna be like you. I spend a whole lot of trying, a whole lot of crying, a lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you. I don't wanna be like you. y'all i am back so i'm at rouse's now just left the nail shop i'm at rouse's i'm gonna fix some um chicken and shrimp alfredo and i need to get uh, a few things from here i have just about everything i need but a few things i don't have so i'm gonna run in here and grab it right quick hopefully i'll just be in and out um but i wanted to tell y'all this that olay product that i'm using i like it y'all i have been using it every day it's the moisturizer with SPF 30 in it for the sunlight. Really soft, making my skin really soft and moisturized. I am loving it. So I'm going to keep on using it. I did have like a little itch at first. <laughs> but I can't exactly say it's from that. So I'm not going to say that. I'm just going to keep using it. And if it starts to irritate or whatever, I'll stop using it. But like I said, at first, like the first, maybe the second day, I got a little itch. But uh, none since then, so I don't know if I can relate it to that. Or maybe I just had an itch that day. But um, I like it, though. So I'm going to keep using it. And, yep, and that's that. So let me go run in Rouse's real quick, y'all, so I can get home um, inside and get some stuff done. Lordy. I don't know. The past couple of weekends, I feel like I'm spinning my wheels and I'm not really getting anything done. Um, I did order some stuff, y'all. I'm about to do a bathroom refresh in both bathrooms. And um, I started ordering stuff. So that's coming as soon as I'm going to wait till everything um, get in and just do it all at one time. So like I said, that's coming up in one of my uh next few vlogs yep and hopefully some more um in home makeover type stuff coming up and y'all i'm about to paint the kitchen again i am about to paint the kitchen i don't even know if it's been a year y'all i don't know when i painted that kitchen but um from purple to blue so now I'm about to change it again, so we're gonna talk about it later. <laughs> Just finished in Rouse's show. I, I got four items. Three of them. Well, I'm gonna cook with all of them. Yep, everything I needed to. Uh, well, the things I didn't have that I needed to fix my Alfredo. Yo, I'm pretty sure I probably uh, talked about, about this on an older vlog. Probably like. I don't know, last year sometime or whatever. Because it's a pet peeve of mine. But I hate, 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 hate with a passion when cashiers lick their fingers to get your bag loose. When they lick their finger, you know, to get those plastic bags. Why would you, why do you think I want to take home or touch or hold or carry a bag that you just put spit on? Then you think you're gonna put my food in that bag and then hand it to me, hand me a wet spit bag? That is that's filthy. I can't stand that. So the people in front of me, so when I went in Rouse's, the cashier, the uh it was a little couple that was shopping, checking out or whatever. They weren't lying in front of me. They were bagging for the cashier, I guess bagging their own stuff. And both of them kept licking their nasty hands to get the bags loose on this one, you know, the little bag rack that sits up on the counter. So one of the racks that they, they were not using. So I was just 
wait for him to finish so I could just use the other rack. Because why? And I hope I'm not offending anybody. Some people do it without even thinking twice about it. But, I mean, you know, most of my life growing up is, is, is something that I never really paid attention to. But at some point, you start thinking, like, no. <laughs> That's not cool. Don't hand me your spit bag. You're literally wetting your fingers with spit to touch the bag that you're going to put my food in and, and, and to me to take with me. Think about that. Like, no. A bit of taste, yeah Even good things leave a bit of taste Worry won't change the outcome But I've been doing this for so long My brain keeps signaling danger Although I know that I'll be just fine Worry won't change the outcome But I've been doing this for so long My brain keeps signaling danger Although I know that I'll be just fine Even good things leave a bit of taste Even good things leave a bit of taste Even good things leave a bit of taste Yeah What's the worst case scenario? Plan out in your head how it's all gonna go So you think you got it covered But there's always something new that you discover you've not thought about Never figure out every possible outcome, and you're so scared you'll get it wrong. Have a good time, but a worry after. Petrified, will they think I'm awkward when your brain's wired for disaster? Even good things leave a bitter taste. Try to calm down, thoughts spinning faster. Terrified, hide it with laughter when your brain's wired for disaster. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Something unexpected happens, you can't let it go. Caught up in your own distractions, you already know that you're gonna think about this for a while. Why you try not to lose your mind, not to believe the lies that you tell yourself that you tell yourself. Have a good time, but a worry after. Petrify when they think I'm awkward. When your brain's wired for disaster. Even good things leave a bit of taste Try to calm down, thoughts spinning faster Terrified, hide it with laughter When your brain's wired for disaster Even good things leave a bit of taste Even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah Even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah Even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah Even good things leave a bit of taste Even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah. Even good things leave a bit of taste, yeah. Even good things leave a bit of taste. Worry won't change the outcome, but I've been doing this for so long. My brain keeps signaling danger, although I know that I'll be just fine. Worry won't change the outcome, but I've been doing this for so long. My brain keeps signaling danger, although I know that I'll be just fine. I've been to myself, just me lately. I don't need a lot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? I've been to myself, just me lately. I don't need a lot. I don't need a lot, no. Just me and the fam, few friends. 